Right, this is our coaching session. Um, I'm Jake, who's going to be the coachee. And I'm Liam, and I'm going to be the coach. Uh, so, Jake, we uh, talked about uh, your learning outcomes when it came to uh, on the Facebook group. Um, how were you thinking about achieving these learning outcomes? Well, uh, just to highlight my learning outcomes again, it's, um, I've obviously split them into personal, academic and career. So I've got improved my confidence around my peers and colleagues during my work uh, experience by experiencing a variety of situations with crying, such as being a key speaker at a meeting or leading the group. So in order to improve my confidence, like I just said, I put, I put myself in unfamiliar situations and I feel like in life I need to do that a bit more, which is why I've made it a personal outcome. But by doing this at work, hopefully I can transfer that skill into my life situations. And also another learning outcome I've got for personal is building professional contacts. Um, I feel this is important because personally, again, you need contacts even just friends to sometimes get you through certain situations. But I think by building professional contacts, um, it allows me to keep in touch with people for the future, um, ask on advice maybe on career path, even if it's not to do with that exact career path, they might just feel they've been in the situation I've been in before and they'd be able to help me. So that'd be good on a personal level. Uh, academically, I'd like to improve my self-evaluation skills uh, by completing regular reflections during my work placement. Um, because sometimes it's hard to be truthful and analytical of yourself because you don't want to tackle the issue, but obviously to improve you need to do that. And I also want to improve my research and preparation skills um, on my placement. And this is to sort of help me academically for next year and last year at Leeds Met. Um, I want to do that by being set tasks, being sort of set tasks weekly on my work placement and being asked to sort of research into certain areas so it, it's upon me to do it and I'm not sort of given the information, I have to go out and find it, that kind of thing. And then um, for career, um, I want to understand what career path I wish to date because I'm not, um, I haven't quite yet decided what I want to do, although finance is an area of interest. And also I want to adopt leadership roles. Um, again, I intend to do this by uh, being at the forefront of groups, doing presentations and things like that. Um, so, where have you applied for, to do your work experience? For, uh, uh, so far, I've contacted Deloitte, who are an audit tax and consulting firm. Um, but I'm going to also contact people like Credit Suisse, uh, BlackRock, KPMG, Capita Group, um, and all these sort of firms and businesses are finance related. Some of them have management skills, audit and tax. And that's just kind of the area I want to go into. Um, I still need to contact a few of them, although um, I have to do this by a range of methods, such as emails or phone calls. So I'm, I'm trying to do that to organise my work placement. And do you think these companies can uh, help you achieve your learning outcomes? Yeah. Um, originally, my first intention was that to uh, make sure I was working at a blue chip company. Um, and I feel like all these companies are so big and based um, in finance that it's uh, important that I sort of make sure I learn from them. Because if I can't learn from the biggest and best, then I can't really learn from anyone. So I think I think these placements would be good, especially if I can achieve one. Yeah, and is finance where you want to go down, or is that just an idea? At the minute, um, I just want to try it because, like I said, I don't, I don't really particularly know what I want to do yet. Um, but because my all my sort of tasks and um, personal reflections have sort of set me to the finance side, I feel it's important that I try and take that route and see if I like it. Yeah. Is there anything yeah. else you want to talk about? Or? Um, no, that'll do. Thank you.